What's happening, everyone? Jay Shockblast here, and check it out. We are about to go unlock Ayla Sakura, one of my absolute favorite Jedi in the whole entire Star Wars universe. Now, as you can see, I don't have her rumor yet, so I'm just going to buy it. All right, so much easier this way. And it looks like all we have to do is travel to Geonosis space. And uh, we'll do a race there, and we will be able to unlock her. So went ahead and bought that rumor, and now I'm going to go ahead and leave Fasana, and we are going to find Geonosis, and we're going to travel to space. Now, originally, I had my mic muted when I went to record this video, and I'm going to be honest, I actually failed this mission the first time I did it. I don't love races personally, but... Um, it wasn't facing me in the right direction. The race ended up not being super bad. Um, we were able to do it. So we're just going to go ahead and travel through here. And we're in Genos in space. I'm leaving some of this in between so that you can see how quickly on Xbox Series X um, everything kind of, all the like fast traveling stuff, the cutscene or the in between works. And at this point, it's really just a matter of finding where the quest is. Now, I don't love space stuff to be honest with you it's not bad it's just hard to track and i get fixated on this right here uh this is a kyber crystal asteroid or kyber brick comet is what it's called so i'm gonna like you know ooh, squirrel gonna go ahead and, and destroy this because breaking one of these gives you five kyber bricks all right so just like that you know we got five kyber bricks you need these to unlock all sorts of abilities and now it's just a matter of finding where the race is. And uh, I see the flag, and I'm like, maybe that's it. Now, I don't have the mission se selected, which is something I learned how to do after the fact. But if you have the mission selected, it does make it a little bit easier uh, to find things. So I, this is the first time I had done anything like this. But as you can see, completing the race in 35 seconds will get you Ayla Sakura. So we're going to go ahead and do that. And uh, as you can see, it's like it wasn't focusing me in the right direction. I don't know. We got through it, though. I think we have a few seconds to spare. There's 17 checkpoints. And I'm very thankful to them for making it so that you don't have to go through Dead Red Center. Uh, and that obviously was a booster. Because some of these, I barely clipped it with, like, the tail of the slave one. And... Uh, I was a little, uh, I don't know, traumatized. So I had five seconds to spare. So it's definitely not like the hardest quest. And uh, if I can do it, you can too, because I'm, I'm street trash. <laughs> so there you go. We've got Ayla Sakura. We've got her unlocked. And uh, we are going to travel somewhere where there's a little bit of light. And for that, I chose, I want to say Coruscant. Coruscant is probably going to be my go-to planet for showing off some of these characters uh, because it's it's bright uh, in the federal district. And obviously you wanna have a lot of light. And obviously look at how quickly we can travel from point A to point B. Uh, obviously this is on Xbox Series X. I would imagine it works the same way on PlayStation 5. I don't know about last gen with Xbox One and PS4, but there you go. So we land in the federal district, kind of, kind of funny. I think Plo Koon is is flying uh, the Slave One. And, oh no, okay, it was Boba Fett, anyway. And, uh, Apalak. <laughs> uh, so we're gonna go in here and the menus are a little bit funky to get used to, but once you do, you're good. So we go into Ayla Sakura. Jedi Master Ayla Sakura is a Twi'lek that served in the Grand Army of the Republic during the Clone Wars commanding the 327th Star Corps as they fought across numerous planets. Her ba bravery in combat made her one of the Republic's most valued generals. I've heard people say Twi'lek. I've heard people say Twi'lek. I don't know. I kind of go in between uh, just to play it down the middle. Plus, if I've learned anything on near in nearly 12 years on YouTube, it's mispronouncing things is going to get you comments. So feel free to correct me in the comments. I said both. I don't care. So here she is. She looks dope. Gotta love her. Uh, I think they're Laku? Nah, Laku might be um, like Shakti and uh, Ahsoka's 
like kind of thing. I don't, I don't remember what they call the the tendrils, if you will. But uh, she's got a blue lightsaber to match her blue skin, and uh, she looks great. So we're just gonna like mess around with her the rest of the way. But that is how you unlock Alis Cora. You should be able to just find that in space, just kind of floating around. So I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. And we'll see ya. Let's <laughs> go. <laughs>